it's your girl joy back with another banger i am about to leave church i went to church with sydney today i am tired i am operating on about three four hours of sleep i'm sure you can tell under my little eyes honey it is what it is i cannot sleep <laughs> i have been obsessed with school stuff um this summer has not been relaxing it has but it hasn't I guess it's, it hasn't been as stressful but we have about three more weeks before school starts and I can feel my anxiety building because there's so much I want to do I'm just obsessed with it and it's like I just I can't relax because I'm always thinking about school stuff uh, and trying to prepare and be ready then I was working on a new product that I want to try to market to students. So, you know, this business idea, my mind has been going a mile a minute. And one thing about having ADHD, it's hard to focus sometimes. And I was at the church service because Sydney is leaving for camp. So they had a send off service and they invited parents and so on and so forth. It was a packed house. Um, she's going on a mission trip. Um, I think she's painting homes or building homes or something like that. And I could not focus on the word. First, I'm trying to listen to the word, listen to the word. I was like, what was that noise? Then I was like, oh my God, I got to try this thing on a computer. I was like, oh, I need to clean the house. The house is a mess. The entire service. It is, it is horrible, y'all. Just not being able to focus or have things that I want to do, want to accomplish. And I just can't. And I will say I tried medicine for a month, but then the doctor wanted me to go back. She didn't want to keep prescribing medicine. She wanted me to um, go back, but my insurance changed and then it was hard to take days off from school and so on and so forth. So she didn't want to refill. So I'm just nervous. And for me to make any type of appointments is like climbing them out. It's just like, it's something I just, I just can't do it's terrible and no one understands what it's like living like this no one understands it and so I'm about to go home I'm tired I'm very very tired but I feel like if I go to sleep <laughs> if I go to sleep I'm gonna be up again late and then I need to get to bed early today is Sunday I don't know when I'm gonna get this up because the next week monday through friday i'll be training so i'm taking a um teacher training so it's like okay now maybe i'll go to the beach i can't even go to the beach because i have training <laughs> for the whole week and i'm a little disappointed that it's um online training from nine to three o'clock every day Ugh. so i'm getting ready to go home and then as i was sitting in church i was like joy go home and mop the floor and clean the kitchen just go ahead and do it but i know what's going to happen i'm gonna go home and i'm not going to do it i've been trying to do it for the past week I, i'm just not gonna do it but baby listen 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 let me tell you before i go oh my little eyes y'all don't worry about it don't worry about it sydney calls me it could have been like 10 30 last night and she calls me and so it's it's crazy so when i answer the phone it's like the first thing I'm tuning into is for crying. I don't know. Maybe it's like PTSD. I don't know. And Sydney was, Mom, Mom, someone's chased me. Child, somebody was following Sydney. I don't know if they were trying to uh, carjack her. Um, I should have had her tell the story, but they tried to cut her off and forced her into um, this church area because they, they were cutting her off. And it was three cars. And she was freaking out. I said, well calm down do not come home i said do you want to call the cops i said just keep driving around do not stop and she drove around for about a good 20 30 minutes to make sure they still weren't following her she was freaking out and um poor thing she was just shaking up i don't understand what happened but i was like they sound like it was road rage because she kind of got in front of a car because she was about to make a turn, but she didn't really cut him off. She said he was about two, three car lengths, you know, between. And 
he was he she said he was yelling stop stop and he tried to cut her off which forced her into a church area and she had to drive into the church area and it was you know 10 10 30 at night and then come back out and she said they followed her for a little while that's weird that's scary she was freaking out so i'm glad she's okay um so you know i knew i was gonna go to church with her <laughs> she needed that you know that reinforcement right there but i could not focus on the word it was, felt good to be there but I, baby i'm tired this little coffee is not working honey she not working but i know if i go home bro it's almost 11 o'clock it's like i'm tired but i'm afraid to go to sleep we need we don't have no food at the house okay there's something to eat like sardines and stuff <laughs> sometimes sardines be hitting the spot how y'all make y'all sardines leave it in the comment section below but baby mince some onions and put it in the sardines with a little bit of mustard and some white crackers baby good and um but you gotta get the sardines that's in the hot sauce good so I don't know I need to cook something I have no desire to cook anymore and it's like the kids don't they don't, they're not cooking and Cindy cooks for herself she just made a whole bunch of food she makes sweet potatoes she'll put those in either the air fryer or she'll put them in the oven she'll make brown rice and um ground turkey and she eats that she just made a whole bunch of that now she's gone she didn't think that through we don't want that <sighs> So, I don't know. I don't know, y'all. It's like I, I have these grandiose ideas in my head and what comes out is baffling. But I'll probably go home and start working on my little product again because I want to, you know, get that out and, you know, try to market that. So, I can't wait to share that with you. <laughs> so, mm. So I'm going to take my tail home. Like I said, I want to clean the kitchen. I want to mop. I want to do this. I want to wash clothes, change my sheets, this, that. Child, I know I'm going to go home and get right in that bed. I just know it. This summer has not been enjoyable at all. It hasn't been bad because I haven't anywhere to go anyway. But I am going to maybe figure out something, probably do something for spring break. I got to do something to make up for this hot mess. <laughs> you know I don't know maybe I'll get to the beach one day and then have to go to Arkansas State for a college tour drops Bobby off at another school so there's a lot going on you know the end of the month but this summer no bueno I ain't do nothing I ain't go nowhere not that I ever go anywhere, but it just seems like I've just been in school mode. I cannot turn it off. It just won't turn off. It's just what it is. It's just on all the time. I guess when you love what you do, it kind of consumes you. People say, you gotta relax, you gotta get about school. I wish I could. I can't. <laughs> I can't. So, let me take my tail. No, we need something from the stove. I don't feel like going to the grocery store. I'll go. Maybe I'll make some fettuccine Alfredo. I love cream sauce. It ain't good for you. But it's good. I'll make it good. What? Good? And people are like, oh, you look nice, child. If I take those shades off and they see these bags under my eyes. I was like, okay, thank you. So I had my little shades on in church. I took them off when service started. And I threw on my little jumpsuit. So I was ready in about five minutes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So let me figure out how to get to this grocery store to get something. I just don't want to cook anymore. I, I don't want to. But I know we need something. Ugh. Well, I did say I was going to the grocery store. I didn't quite make it there I, I decided to go over here first so I'm gonna go in there I'm going in there to look at some patterns since 
my money is always funny. I'm going in there to find a pattern to make a few skirts for school. You know, every day is like a costume for me and the kids love it. So I'm just gonna see what I can find. Um, a few patterns. I wanna make at least three, four skirts before school starts. And they're not perfect. Do I sew for a living? Nope. They make my nerves bad. Yup. So what I'll do now, <clears throat> I'm gonna go look at some material just to see. Cause cutting and pinning stuff takes patience. The sewing part takes patience too. So I'm going to see if I find any fabric that jumps out at me. And of course I want it to be fun and playful, whimsical. shimmer to it. You know, that one is the only one jumping out at me. I really like her. She's pretty. Hmm. Well, I was in Joanne's fabrics for a very long time. I spent more than I anticipated. And after <laughs> after um, he cut the fabric and then I looked at the price when he gave, when he gave me the ticket, I was like, uh, I wonder if I could put this back. Baby, this was not in my cards. But he already cut it. So <laughs> I wanted to send it back so badly. But I fell in love with this one. I think she is so cute. I love her. I just love this one. And then I am so sleepy, y'all. And then I got this one because I just thought she was pretty too. So now, since I spent all this dang money, so I got four yards of each one. And I think I have another pattern at the house. And I ended up getting this pattern. I like this dress. Um, I don't know. I'll see, you know, sewing. I'm not an expert at the sewing, but I just make it do that and I forgot to get a zipper. Look, let me see if I could put this thing together. Lord help me. I did not plan on spending that much. I want to, I want to take it back. Well, I guess that'll be my outfit for the new year, child. Woo, I'm sleepy. I'm getting kind of hungry. 
it's 12 o'clock and I usually don't get hungry till around three four o'clock so in order to eat a little lighter I'm going to mix some noodles with this I need to get my own machine because it's so good the alfredo is so good with this and then I'm gonna get some broccoli to add to it this is gonna be my little treat. I love this. Love, love, love. I'm gonna get some spinach. Um, I'm gonna get a bunch of spinach. Spinach and just need some broccoli. grocery store once again spent more than I planned wasn't in my budget but we really have much at the house and Bobby I know she's been craving cereal we haven't had milk in ages dang it I ain't getting any coffee I got one more curry cup left just one more and I am so tired I did pick up a salad so I want to go home and cook well, I guess I could do it later because I know Bobby, she's going to be hungry when she gets home. Kind of wanted to have, so she's working a double. So, but I also want to get some rest. I don't know, guys. It's one o'clock now. Maybe I can eat a little bit of salad. Lie down for a little, for a couple of hours and then around five, six o'clock, get up and make dinner. I think that's going to be the plan. Uh, uh, I bought some hot dogs. So if she is hungry, she can make a hot dog. Good night, blue cheese. Okay. And then Sydney has been driving my car. When she had my car, my tank was full. And gas prices, oh my God, are through the roof right now. So I got my car now. It's 76 miles to empty. Oh no ma'am, I'll be getting gas and taking it right out of your account because right now both kids have more money than I do. Baby, I will be taking that money right out of their account. Mm-mm. You drive, you gotta you gotta pick get gas. Mm-mm. So that's what I'll be doing. Think she's slick. Now she out of town. Mm-mm, baby. You've been driving all around town like the car is yours. Not that I have anywhere to go anyway. I'm going to make up for this. I am. It's going to be okay because it's going to be a good school year. Okay, period. Okay? It's the sacrifice. And I can't help myself anyway. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me. I'm almost home. 
Ooh, I'm passing all these fast food restaurants. Sister hungry? Now nah, I'm hungry again, probably because I see all these little fast food spots. That's all right, I'm gonna go home to eat because I done spent money that I didn't really have to spend. And I don't do credit cards. Mm -mm. So if I can't afford it, I don't buy it. That's why my card was the little mini card. I didn't get the big card because you know when you get the big card, you want to fill up the big card. And I got chicken thighs, which is a dark meat. I like dark meat. And it's like it's juicy, y'all. So I'm just going to cook that. Nothing fancy, just so there's a protein to have with the fettuccine alfredo. And I already have some heavy whipping cream at home. So I bought half and a half to balance it out and the um, spiral zucchini, which is phenomenal. Oh my gosh, it is so, so good with Alfredo sauce. So I'll do half pasta, half the zucchini, but I wanna get the machine so I could make my own so it's fresh. But I was glad it was 50% off because it's like six, seven dollars for that stuff. But it's really good. It's 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 worth it. And it's a nice balance. And I can eat fettuccine. I can eat the Alfredo just with the um zucchini. It's super good. It's that good. So and I've made my uh Alfredo sauce online before, so all right, I'm about to turn into the house. I will check you guys later. If I don't get you later, bye y'all. This is terrible. I ate my salad. I watched some movie on Hulu. Um, I think it's Black Lady TV. She gave me her coat. <laughs> I still use it from time to time, girl. <laughs> and I was like, I'm going to go to sleep. I'm going to go to sleep. But look what I'm doing. Crawled in bed. And now I think it's 3.34 o'clock. I'm like, I might as well just stay up now. Look what I'm doing. In bed with my computer. I just can't win. I have to remember that today is Sunday and I'm about to set some alarms for the rest of the week to get up at 7.30 because I have training from eight to three all week. Fun, fun. So I hope it's interesting. Hope I learned something. I was like, Joy, why don't you read? Joy, why don't you do this? Child, it don't make sense to go to sleep now. I should try to stay up at least to 6, 7 o'clock and make that pasta, which I'm not hungry, but Bobby might be hungry. Although she'll go out and buy herself something to eat real quick. Mm, don't get me started on that, y'all. All right, so let me do some work on a computer. Already looked up my login information for my training tomorrow so i did that i'm really excited and so tomorrow i need to look up some doctors everybody needs checkups before we go back to school see that's what i'm saying in my head that's what i want to do in my spirit but will that happen who knows <laughs>